Hello everybody, welcome back here to uh, franktortorici.com. Uh, again, as I say in all the other videos, whether you're here through Facebook, Twitter, my website, YouTube, I want to welcome you here, and uh, let's get right cracking to it. Again, I'm trying to keep these a little bit shorter and more sweet and simple and to the point. So I just wanted to show you guys, I, I'm just a little lit up, I was just watching online a little video clip, about a 20 minute video clip on Dr. Joel Furman, MD, medical doctor. And again, I want to share this because, again, my credentials is my, you know, my, my passageway in order to share this is just being a physical fitness trainer for the last 14 years and obviously my long journey through healing my body with Tourette's syndrome by natural means of food and herbs. Uh, so Dr. Joel Furman, again, he's a medical doctor. Anytime I come across a medical doctor that speaks the language that I believe in, uh, it just gets me stoked and I want to share it. So... Dr. Joe Furman, he's the author of many of books, but one of the famous books he's written is called Eat to Live. It's been published in many different languages. Basically, this, this video, just to sum it up, uh, you're not going to hear anything different come out of my mouth than you've heard in past video blogs. Dr. Furman has, is, a, is a family physician, medical doctor, board certified, and he treats people basically that come to him with diseases like cholesterol, high blood pressure, diabetes, lupus, uh, obesity, things, things like that, allergies and things of that nature. So, you know, it, it all, whether it's diabetes or cholesterol or high blood pressure, there's always a cause to these things. And, you know, what I've always believed and what the evidence shows and in, in, in what he is teaching to people is very simple. I mean, no disease exists in our body without a cause to it. And one of the biggest problems that with the, the industry of what we think wellness of us going to see our doctors is that it's, it's too time consuming for doctors to have to sit with you and actually map out a wellness plan for you. Again, we live in America, the land of opportunity. So our main objective is to have enough time to go out in the world and make money and not spend so much time on the things that really matter in our lives like meditation, prayer, exercise, and putting the right foods in our body. That takes too much time, and obviously lots of big companies are not pushing that down your throat and trying to educate that to you because there's no money to be made in that. So, you know, it's very interesting that we walk around in this society thinking it's normal uh, for us to have high blood pressure when we hit our 40s and 50s because we're getting older. Uh, diabetes, the same things, although that is actually... Uh, unveiling a new leaf in that spectrum of diabetes because we're seeing kids 14, 15 years old getting diabetes. So, you know, yeah, there are things that we do inherit it and, and inherit from our parents and from our great grandparents when you look at DNA and chromosomes. But when it comes to health issues, our health is completely right here. It is in our hands. I don't care. I mean, yes, you hear of things where people, you know, you hear of little kids coming down with leukemia and things like that. Of course, that's a much different story. But when you look at ailments like diabetes, obesity, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, those are all things that are created by one thing or a few things. And the major things that it really attributes to are stress and crappy foods and just our overall lifestyle in general. So, you know, it's very misleading that when you go to your doctor, they kind of tell you that, oh, you have high blood pressure, you have diabetes, you're stuck with it, this is what you have to do. But, you know, it falls back to that, that principle that I always say. It's like the Band-Aid effect. Going to your local doctor and getting put on a medication for something like diabetes or high cholesterol or high blood pressure is like the Band-Aid effect. It's like cutting yourself and putting a Band-Aid on. Then cutting yourself the next day, putting another Band-Aid on. You're constantly keeping that process of reopening that womb, and it's never actually healing. So if you never get to the root cause of what's causing the diabetes or the high blood pressure or the high cholesterol, then how do you expect to ever correct it just through a magic pill? It's just not going to happen. It's, 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 common, it's common sense when you break it down like that. Now, again, these are just my hardcore beliefs, but when I see medical doctors that are board certified speaking this information, it's very refreshing because apparently you don't need to be a doctor to adapt these principles and lifestyles in your life. Okay, it's not just uh, rocket science here where you need a degree to be a medical doctor to actually be healthy. It falls back down to the principles of common sense. You know, we are, we are ingesting way too many calories and way too much unwanted, unhealthy, saturated fats in our diet. 
And when you incorporate all these empty calories, fried foods, carbohydrates, processed sugars, all these synthetic chemicals that are in all of our foods on a mass scale standpoint, you are going to keep seeing an increase of diabetes, high cholesterol, high blood pressure, and obesity, and things of that nature. And we're seeing it little by little by little by little. It's happening more and more and more and more and more. And why? Because when you flip on the television station, you're not educated uh, in the sense of what the benefits are of phytonutrients and different types of fruits and vegetables. There's not a lot of money to be made in that. So instead, as Dr. Furman, Dr. Joe Furman pointed out in this video, which is so true, you know, we, we go to our doctor and we find out we're lacking B12. Most Americans are lacking B12, calcium, vitamin C. So what do you see it in now? Oh, well, now you see when you go through the cereal aisle, say, for kids, you'll see, um, you know, what, what's a, what's a uh, cereal? Well, you'll see Cheerios, or you'll see Lucky Charms, and it'll see, uh, or you'll see Tropicana orange juice, and it'll say added calcium to it. So now you just have the synthetic compounds of what they're making the food with, and now you just have the synthetic compound of the vitamin added to it. And, you know, we as parents, if we don't educate ourselves in this stuff, we feed that to our children, thinking that our children is growing, and they're getting their extra calcium through their Lucky Charms bowl of cereal in the morning. And that's just pure insanity. So when you really look at it like that, it really starts to make sense. So again, you don't need to be a medical doctor to, to implement this in your life and in your family's life. It's very simple, and the, the beginning and the end journey starts with you, right here, right now, as you're listening to this video. So again, don't take my word for it. Why don't you Google Dr. Joel Furman, uh, author of Eat to Live, and as I said, many of other books. He is a medical doctor, again, a medical doctor. He's just one of the rare that actually speak the truth of wellness. Okay? So I hope this video brings some clarity and light to you guys. Again, I'm Frank Tortorici. My website is www.franktortorici.com. That's T-O-R-T-O-R-I-C-I.com. You can find me on Facebook, Twitter. The YouTube channel is Rebirth028. Uh, subscribe to the channel. There's tons of videos like this and much, much more to come. Again, I'm a personal trainer, holistic life coach, nutritionist. I'm available for all, th all three of those types of uh, services, uh, meal planning, corporate speaking events, you name it. So again, this is just about passing this information around and again, keeping our health right in our own hands because that's the only way we could ever achieve and maintain optimum wellness in our life and in our loved ones' lives. So again, please pass these videos along to your family and friends. You will save a life and actually change some others. And uh, keep the comments flowing, and I'll keep addressing some questions through these videos, and we'll talk soon. Peace and love, everyone.